First start by securing the thread behind the eye of the hook, cover the shank with thread, and clip off the tag end. Now we're going to take a set of brass eyes and secure them just behind the eye of the hook. Crisscross your thread wraps until the eyes are thoroughly secure. Now bring your thread back to the bend of the hook and we will take a clump of light pink marabou and secure this right at the bend of the hook. You want your tail to be about the length of the shank or maybe a tad longer. You will want to secure the stem of the marabou down so we have a nice even body on the fly. This will come in handy later on. Now bring your thread back to the bend of the hook again and we will add a second clump of purple marabou and repeat what we did previously with the pink. Now take a clump of several strands of holographic flashaboo and secure these to each side of the fly. Try to place the flash right in between the two clumps of marabou, almost like a lateral line. Clip the excess flashaboo. You want your flash to be as long as the tail of the fly. Now we're going to take a piece of purple saddle hackle and tie this in at the tip of the feather. Now we're going to take a piece of fluorescent pink Antron yarn, tie this in near the eyes of the hook, and tie it all the way down back to the bend of the hook. Bring your thread forward and begin wrapping. Try to create a nice, smooth, even body. Once we have created our body, tie off the Antron yarn and clip off the excess. Now we're going to wrap our purple saddle hackle forward. Try and evenly space these wraps out. We're going to do about seven or eight wraps. Once you reach the eyes of the hook, tie off the saddle hackle and clip off the excess. Place some extra security wraps forward and back and it's time to whip finish. Whip finish and clip off the thread and you now have yourself the Alaska Dredger.